Harambe! 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 Nimesema hayo kwa sababu yale ndio yalifanyika hapa miaka 58 iliyopita. Your Excellency, I have only two things that I want to tell Kenyans today. First way is true what you have said here about this ground. But the Kenyans must also know that this ground was not chosen for no reason. One, there was a motion in Parliament, and I see the speakers here, then called Legico, about the site. Then there were three sites. One was along what was called Princess Elizabeth Highway, now Uhuru Highway, and that was Uhuru Park. The other one was called Mitchell Park, which is today called Jamhuri Park, or ASK Grounds. This one here was called a, a open ground next to Nairobi Dam. This one was chosen because it was a, a concentration camp where, as the president has said, freedom fighters were tortured, like they were tortured in Hitler's Auschwitz and Buchenwald. Here, next to the Western Hotel, which was part of this ground, in Langata Primary School, there are torture chambers which have been preserved by the Museum of Kenya for people to know where we are coming from. Your Excellency, what you've done here is great. I'd ask you when you went to Namibia to go and look at what they have done. When you came back, you told me we'll do better. We'll actually come up with the best in Africa. How we are going to remember our past. There are those who say, forget about the past. We want to look at the future. The past is very important because if you don't really look at the past, your legs will repeat the same mistakes made in the past. And here, Your Excellency, you say that you want history unedited here. People will come to know who Wayaki Wahinga was, who Haridhuku was, and so many of those are our heroes here. Many of Kenyan patriots have worked here, historians, geologists, anthropologists, uh, uh, political scientists, architects, engineers have worked here. And people are going to be surprised at what you've done here. It shows your vision for this nation, for our country. So we, therefore, Your Excellency, I want to congratulate you in front of fellow Kenyans here for the work that you've done that will only be recognized many years after you've left office. So we congratulate you. And this land had been grabbed, but those land grabbers would not see any open space and stop grabbing them. But you managed to retrieve it back for the benefit of our people. And it's going to remain truly Uhuru Gardens, where we also are going to bury our heroes and remember them for posterity. I thank you. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year.